Hey guys, bringing you another do-it-yourself computer video today. In this video, I'm going to show you how to uninstall uh, or stop pop-ups from McAfee or Norton Antivirus. Uh, they can be super annoying. Um, sometimes they act like malware themselves, always asking you to uh, upgrade or subscribe or whatever. So I'm going to show you how to, how to take those off of your computer, stop them from happening. Uh, there's two main ways you can be getting these. Either you've downloaded something accidentally that's physically downloaded to your computer, or it's just infected your browser. Uh, so I'm going to show you those two ways of removing it. Uh, if you've actually downloaded it the first way, I'll show you how to get in there now and uninstall it. So to uninstall it, come down here to your search bar in the bottom left corner and type in Control Panel. Control Panel app will pop up, hit Enter to select. Down here under Programs, click on Uninstall a Program. Now this computer for me is just a prop computer that I use for my videos. So there's very few things installed because this is not a used computer. Your computer will have a long list of a lot of different programs, possibly pages and pages long. What you want to do here is scroll down through this list, find either McAfee or Norton or, or whatever you're looking to uninstall and, and double click on it. A dialog box will pop up and you would hit uninstall or you would select yes to confirm that you want to uninstall it. So that's how you would delete it if it's installed onto your computer. Now if the only time you generally see the pop-ups is not when you're working on your computer, but when you open a browser window, that's a good clue that it's infected your browser and not necessarily something you downloaded. So assuming it's the second item we talked about and it's infected your browser, I'll show you how to go ahead now and clean that up. So go ahead and open your browser and assuming we're all using Google Chrome, Up here in the top right, you'll see those three dots way up in the corner. We're going to go get those. Scroll down to where it says settings. Now we're going to scroll all the way down on your next window. All the way down to the bottom, it'll say advanced. Now we're going to scroll down again. And down here it'll say restore settings to their original defaults. Click on that. Now this won't delete your bookmarks. It won't delete your saved passwords. What this is going to do is it's going to reset the other settings for your browser. And this should stop the infection if it is just infecting your browser. So those are the two main ways that something like this can infect your computer, whether it's an accidental download or whether it's just on your browser. So if you have any questions or comments, please check out the frequently asked questions below in the description. Uh, if you don't see yours, feel free to leave me a comment. I try to get back to you guys a few times a day at least. Uh, and uh, like and share, this is helpful. And subscribe if you enjoy do-it-yourself computer work. Thanks for watching, guys.